of the morning to y'all. Hey, this week I went metal detecting in Little Rock, Arkansas, and it was muddy. Yeah, cool. Metal detecting out there was like listening to a Sleepy Joe speech. A whole lot of confusion and a lot of slip ups. Hey, if that last joke didn't send you packing, God bless you, God bless Texas, and I hope you enjoy the video. So I just dug this bullet, and I'm no Civil War expert, so Ram detecting said, you got something? I was like, it looks like a spread out three ringer. He said, let me see that. So I showed it to him and he said, oh my God. The ringtail sharks. So these are like extremely rare, especially for this area. I think probably out of the 3,000 bullets we've dug out here, three have been found. All right. It's a little jumpy, but it's in the range. Oh, nope, there it is. We got one. It's a bullet. Sweet. <laughs> yeah. Nice. There it is, another three ringer. Oh, no, wait. What? What's that? Let's check it out. That's been rammed real hard. Oh, has it? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I got excited. I thought I had a really rare silver. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, man. Welcome to Ram Detecting. There, <laughs> there you go. go. Is that where that came from? Yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, I can't win. I got a bullet, guys. Look like Jeremy got a bullet. Right, Jeremy said, nice. Miles of Lonesome Highway and Russ Barbarona stories. <laughs> and here I am in the field with Mark Duncan and Russ Barbarona, the field of dreams. Thank Woo! You yes. <laughs> nice, brother. 20 years. Right here. 20 years. <laughs> yep. Booga! Yeah. Right in the muddy, man. Nice job. Awesome, guys. Awesome. Sweet, buddy. Congrats, what machine you dig it with? F-75! Yeah. Calm it. Bullet. That's not. I see it. Ah, oh, sucky. Nice. Nice. Man, dude. Nothing like it. I love it. I know. Uh -huh. Yep. Yep. That's the magic. Just dropped it. Oh, damn. Is it? It's right there See in his it? hand. Check yep. it out. <laughs> nice. Can. Yeah. Sweet, awesome, brother. man. Nice. Awesome. Nice, man. I'll tell you, the T2 with that 12 coil DD, man, I'll tell you, that coil is great. Cause I run it on the T2, you run it on the F75, you run it on the Time Ranger Pro. I mean, you can't beat that coil. It's Absolutely. deep, it's, awesome. it's fast, it's a good coil. Works really good in iron too. It does. Nice bullet from the American Civil War. Well done, brother. So, yeah, I'm gonna chase it. It's a little higher. Normally I've been down in the like 74 to 79. Uh, I see it. Double impact. Right there. See it? Yes. Nice. 160 years ago. It's crazy, isn't it? A Civil War soldier was out here. Yeah, that's the coolest part. It's been lying there waiting for me. And my T2. Look at that. <laughs> it's beautiful. It's awesome. Love it. Now, everybody got a bunch of bullets, man. Yeah, we all got a handful, didn't we? We sure, sure did. Right Aren't they beautiful? The this, is, this is my little group in here. Here's Mark and Russ. And Russ, what was that you found? Ringtail Sharps? Uh, I think it's actually, the, the real name is a, a spread out three ringer. Spread out three ringer. That's what it's called, technically now, right? Technically, it's <laughs> called. Uh, in the, if I go home and look in the book, it's called the spread out three ring. Mark Duncan of Ram Detecting, so go check his channel out. And everybody knows Russ Barbarona, American Detection, First Texas Products. Just the all-American detectors right well, there. I appreciate that. Thank you, sir. 